All right, joke episode. Matt McKay is playing. <laughs> <laughs> Watch him do it better than me. So uh, you have to you have to use your antibiotics, the top one. Move that up. There you go. And, and then slap that shit on. Yeah. There yeah. You go. And then put it all the way to the right and the left. All the way left. Yeah. Cut that shit up. Oh. What about the core? So push left and then do it, right? Well, it's that one's down, 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 and left. Down, down, left. Down, down, down and left. Yeah. Then push A. Alright, you gotta use the ultrasound. Yeah. Alright, nigga, zap with your laser gun. Go down. Zap, yeah, you fucking did it. You're so good at doctoring. <laughs> Don't right. just zap it, you'll make a hole. Up and right. What? Right. Up and right. Push up. Push B on that gray one. No. You gotta get your needle out, yo. Okay, whatever. Just, yeah, inject him with that. No, you, okay, push B. inject him with that. Okay. Go, go to the white one. Okay. Now push B. Now push B somewhere inside of him. And what the fuck is B? Out of here! He's of the dying! Bag. <laughs> He's dying! No! Ah! <laughs> Hurry! Draw a pentagram! Ah! No. Okay. He's I tried, man. If I knew the controls, I might have been able to. Shut up, lady. Who are you? Who are you, people? Who are you? Alright, guys, good night. Bye. 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 Okay, we're gonna do it this time. I swear it. Where is the gallstones? Yeah. Oh, yeah, that, that hemorrhage. That hemorrhage is. I wish, like, like in real life, things that you needed to cut would just glow bright turquoise. Yeah, really, right? Then again, like, would it be defined by what the person thinks should be cut the fuck up, or what should actually be cut the fuck up? Because uh, he's supposed to be a trained doctor, and he's dying, by the way. She... Oh fuck! See, this would be a really good one to have when you're like two people. <laughs> yeah, really. <laughs> <laughs> I quit during the wrong time. This guy's gonna get fucked up now. Uh. Oh god. Oh, oh fuck. He he dead. Oh god, oh fuck's sake. Oh man. He needs Five Satan five powers. Use the power of religion. Religion! Oh god, that was huge. Well, seriously, use your pen around me. You should. Oh shit! I said you should. It's kind of freaking the fuck out of you. Yeah, no shit. Use the power! But no, not until I've completed gallstone removals. That's probably all that there is to it. That was lucky. <laughs> oh god. Jesus Christ, man. Get rid of that shit. Uh... Okay, they're all done. Really? Wow. See, I told you you shouldn't use your powers when you had the chance. I don't need to do that. <laughs> I'm a doctor. Damn it, Jim, I'm a doctor. Did it! Yeah. Ooh, he's going to live. I like how the actual, like, sprite thing is white person, and he's just operating on a black individual. I also like how I zapped robot viruses with lasers, 
and removing a gallbladder was hard. <laughs> well, I was helping him. <laughs> so, so. <laughs> I guess it was a good chance to get our feet wet. You always see the positive, Val. Oh, you're leaving? Yeah. I was glad to hear the operation went well. Of course, I'd expect nothing less. Bitch. We always do our best. I hear that often. But for some reason, this time I believe it. Oh, because I don't Tomorrow, believe other people. To discuss stigma. I'm counting on you. Hey, who told you about that? Like she said, we always do our best. <clears throat> Oh, Those no. capitals are not loud enough. We have enough time to do one more. Q and A. Q&A. Oh, great. It's gonna be all about Dr. Watkins. Christopher Watkins. I thought you just said that we don't have to worry about that shit. Wow, you yeah, assisted an operation. Oh, that girl has short hair, therefore attractive. You must be good. Kidding. No, it's the doctor's word. <laughs> 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 In my case, it depends on who I'm assisting. Bounce. I get along with Dr. Everett, but Dr. Izuchi, on the other hand. Oh, forget I said anything. By the way, Ms. Newman, about the operating room support system. Oh, call me Leslie. Everyone else does. Now, it's our responsibility as nurses to manage the support system. I can't system. tell if she looks like a lesbian. Yeah, lesbian. Time, but once you get used what? to it, you'll be able to have... update it. <laughs> lesbian <laughs> tension? Is that lesbian. what you're saying? Lesbian. Lesbian. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that's what I said. Lesbian tension. Exactly. You don't like it. You don't have You don't know that. Wanna give it a try? Oh. There are some girls now with like short hair that are not lesbian. Anymore. I'd love to. But yeah, bro. This is some lesbian tension right now. <laughs> Regarding this new disease, which has tentatively been named stigma, we received a report from the National Security Council and have begun an independent investigation. Its threat level is unknown. But I can say that the pathogen possesses astonishing mobility. Maybe. It was unclear whether it Maybe. even existed until now. The Wilkins case put an end to the debate. And we are basing that assumption on the testimony. Hey, you're the one that interrupted my surgery. <laughs> <laughs> oh, pardon me. Whoa! I'm Her glasses can turn on and off. Here. It's nice to meet you both. You're absolutely correct, Kanai. While the information provided by Dr. Vaughn and Dr. Blaylock is highly reliable. Our own investigation at Concordia also validates the theory. And so what's Vaughn's first name? Marcus. All right. Keep Professor forgetting. Wilkins was <laughs> conducting all the research on his own, without help from other doctors. He, he what has is two that? first names. a month there following your transfer from <laughs> But during that time, the professor seemed somewhat paranoid about an information leak. To be honest, I'm surprised there was a leak, no matter how small. The NSC never tells us their source of information. I bet the military is involved in it somehow. He does look way more Let's stereotypical. Do <laughs> Jesus Christ. At this point, the research can no God longer damn it, be exclusively to Wilkins. It's now the concern of our entire organization. What? Prior to your transfer here, we received reports Why doesn't she have like an Asian accent like that other woman? I don't know. <laughs> We've already discussed those cases. Because she doesn't have those <laughs> eyes? <laughs> The pathogens in question were she has the eyebrows. various parasites, so nothing was conclusive. If Jesus, she had a lot of occur, X's. They should now be reported to Caduceus International. No, she's it's just pretty though, that Professor Wilkins' data was destroyed. And by an unidentified assailant at that. Am I the only one here who feels uneasy about this? Probably. We're hoping that the professor is still alive. From now on, if any new cases of stigma arise here in the U.S., the patients will be transferred to this facility whenever possible. Wow. Both health That's and human services and the national security. Kind of a big, big deal. Every single person in the United world. States of America that has <laughs> stigma will come here in one place. Yeah, and we're going to be operating on them. And just those two people. Yeah, yeah that's it. <laughs> I hope it doesn't become an epidemic. I personally still will. Probably fucking will. 100%. Unlike the rest of you. The rest of you will be invited to <laughs> the rest of you. very soon. I look forward to seeing the infamous healing touch. You already saw it on my gallbladder expedition. <laughs> Well, technically, on the one you did it right. Well, the little unexpected. <laughs> what have we gotten ourselves into, Marcus? Oh, crap. Were you as shocked as I was by what they already knew? Not really. A doctor considers any and all possibilities. <laughs> well, I... Because you're not a doctor. <laughs> I had no idea there was data on stigma, other than what the professor had collected. They just well, said the professor collected it on his own. We're leaving for the tech <laughs> department tomorrow morning at day, right? Yes, so don't be late. 
All right, then I'm going to go home and get some sleep. Doctor, we just received an emergency request for help. What happened? There was a big accident on the freeway. More than 30 people are in serious And condition. we're going to take care of one of them. They're yeah. requesting the state <laughs> hospital. Now I feel right at home. Elena, can you let them know that we'll accept the patients? Nope. <laughs> Robert <laughs> Matthews, accident victim with chest complications. Deal tales unknown. She has, she has pretty no complications. Incoherent <laughs> speech, decerebrate posture, E1, V3, M2. I don't know what those mean. Uh, I don't either. He's under eight on the Glasgow Coma Scale. He's in critical condition. Okay. The patient has taken considerable damage to the right half of his body, and his lungs may be at risk. He's definitely in bad shape. The exact locations of Wow, what a bland ass name. Right Robert now. Matthews. Hey, they're in Maryland. His vitals aren't stable. <laughs> so? <laughs> Please hurry. They're allowed Please to have bland names. Let's begin immediately. <laughs> Apparently. Okay, let's get started. Okay. Oh, he's got glass in his. Yes. The they always look so that damn ridiculous. Doctor. Yeah. Good job noticing Sherlock Holmes. There was a cut at least as big before you even fucking did that. Yeah, really. Okay. Confirming interior wounds and the presence of foreign debris. Let's keep an eye on his vitals and treat everything we can. He's got that. I know. Yeah, yeah, we've done this before. And bring it toward the other side to close it. Please suture it quickly. Close the room before it hemorrhages again. Pinchy pitch. Yay. I wish I had a laser gun that would suture things. Now to move on to the others. Oh! Excuse me? What is this guy's problem? What are you referring to? He has chest complications. It's very complicated. Oh, jeez. Very complicated chest. Cool. You did a very good job placing that thing in the tray. <laughs> oh, jeez. Oh. <laughs> you have holes in you. We're gonna make some more. <laughs> Gel I did. The tore open into a Where? Just zoom and stuff. Or not. Oh. Oh boy. He's having some issues up in this area. <laughs> <laughs> you didn't even get on it! <laughs> hey, this is Caduceus, we don't give a shit! <laughs> is he safe? No? Oh well. <laughs> Caduceus. <laughs> let's move on to the next one, of 30. Alright, let's close him up. Well, that was a nice change of pace, that seemed really easy. She, she's got the carrot eyes. You know, the carrot face. The carrot face. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, we're done. We're done. <laughs> Yay! We're done. We got a C for crap. No, wait, we get to see more of the story? I forgot. That was the last of the patients. The three of you can wrap things up. Okay, what happened to the other 29? <laughs> They, they just they, they took care of them. They conveniently died. That was very impressive. If you don't mind, I'd like to assist you again sometime. You weren't even there. It's 3 a.m. Yeah, talk about a long day. Well, this yeah, is it took all day to suit that guy up again. I really fucked him up. I guess that's the life of a doctor, no matter where you are. Alright, I'll see you tomorrow. Bright and early. Hey, don't worry. If we can 
survive in Alaska, we can survive anywhere. I, I disagree. Yeah. All right. Yay, see for crappy. That just about does it. Yay. Yay. See you guys in the next episode. Uh, thanks for watching.